Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to my how to create a resource pack for the newest Minecraft 1.6. Uh, they basically changed what used to be called texture packs. Well, you might have texture packs here um, because if you're, you know, if you're using um, any 1.5s, uh, you'll still have a texture pack folder. Um, the thing that I would recommend is once 1.6 is officially out, just delete your .minecraft folder um, and save, you know, like your saves, back them up, your screenshots, back them up, and, uh, you know, get a fresh install because there's a bunch of stuff here and you don't want to, you know, crowd up your .minecraft. But regardless of that, how to create a resource pack, it's, it's really actually simple. Um, once you know where everything is and what to put the uh, folders in, it's really simple. So the first I want to say is resource pack. Um, you need to first you want to make a, a folder and I've already made a resource pack uh, just for the sake of time and uh, this just I'm just gonna call it, I just called the YouTube pack inside are three things your assets folder a pack made a full file and a pack PNG the pack PNG basically is a logo for your pack um, the pack dot MC meta is more of an information um, for I guess the developers you know if you want to name it and whatnot so that's that and assets are what you modify so you want to first create the assets folder then a minecraft folder anything in this minecraft folder is what you're gonna get from the assets files in dot minecraft or your jar now I, I only modified the stone I just made it all black to show yet to show you know how it's persistent with the jar so if I go here jar assets minecraft textures blocks so if I go back here if I go to resource pack minecraft textures blocks there's the block so what I'm trying to say is the Things that you're going to modify, make sure that they are in sync with the file directory of how they are in the actual like file, the, the default files. So I also modified some sounds. So your sounds or anything, you know, record regarding, um, it's going to be in your assets folder in the dot Minecraft. Anything in here you can, I'm pretty sure you can modify. Um, I've only modified sound and records. Um, I haven't done music. So, you know, that might be something else you could modify. But what I know for modifying sounds and records, you copy the same format, you copy the sound folder, you put it into your resource pack folder under Minecraft, so sound. And uh, yeah, you just go from there. Now, you, like I said before, is you have to keep everything like default. That includes file names so for example uh, my mobs my creeper it says say one say two say three say four these are what a mine uh, a creeper would say when you hit them but what I've done is I've taken the villager sounds and I've replaced them here so when I get back when I cut over to some game footage you'll hear that same thing with the uh, piston I don't know why it's in tile I don't know why it's like that but tile piston in and out the in and out sounds have been modified to sound like a, a villager. So I'm hoping with just this basic stuff, you'll be able to copy everything and, you know, design your own resource pack. Um, again, resource packs are what texture packs used to be, but now they are more. You can modify almost anything texture pack wise and sound wise. Um, so Resource, pack, resource packs are mainly for people that create texture packs or people that create custom maps that want to change the like the experience. For example, a door. You might want to make a wooden door sound like a like a, a, a space door, like a like something like that. So you can do that in with a resource pack. But again, it's not I wouldn't suggest it for daily use. Um, that's why I saw my faithful pack. I'm going to be leaving this as is. Um, here's, you know, this is just what the faithful pack looks like. All the blocks are here. Everything is flat now. So you can modify just the ore and it, it gets rotated. Logs now have tops. 
So I'm hoping that uh, the faithful crew um, modify the tops to look according like their, you know, the actual color of the birch. Like uh, I saw on Reddit, someone modified the tops to kind of look like the color of the side. And I really like that. And um, yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to cut over to some gameplay footage and I'm going to show you what I've done with the YouTube pack. Okay, so I'm here in uh, Creative World. And what we got here is our piston and a creeper. So like I said, what I've modified with sounds is the in and out sounds. And when I hit creeper, wow, I didn't realize I was going to hit it that far. But you can tell now when I hit this or when he falls, he sounds like a villager. So yeah, obviously the... The clicking sound is because of the lever, but this, the, the piston itself, it sounds like a villager. So again, like I said, you can modify, you know, any sound you want in game. You know, you can make like a, you know, a villager sound like an ender dragon or a wither. Like, it's basically endless possibilities. But like I said, it the resource pack now is mainly for... You know, people that create maps that want to give a extra experience to their map without physically, you know, making a mod or whatever. And uh, same thing with texture pack users. Texture pack uh, creators can now modify whatever they want. Um, I've created. <laughs> well, my stone is black. It's pure black now. Um, so yeah, that's kind of weird. But uh, but yeah, I'm hoping that this video has helped in some sort of way on how to create a resource pack. Um, if it did, make sure to, uh, you know, let me know in the comment section below or uh, give the video a thumbs up and let some other people know about it. But, uh, yeah, guys, this is it for, um, the resource pack on how to make it for 1.6 and beyond, I guess, um, whenever they change the file format it again. But, um, I'm going to end off the video right here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you're new to the channel and want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I have a Twitter, Facebook, those links will be in the description. Um, but, uh, yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed another Minecraft video. I'm DJPartisan9, and I'll see you guys in another video. I'm out. Peace.